Good morning, Royals. Today is September 28, 2022. My name is Davis Garrick. And I am Brandon, and this, this is, is the Royal, Royal Rundown. Rundown. For upcoming club meetings, there is a guitar club that has flyers around the school, ski slash snowboard call out, and a quiz bowl call out. For our Gen Z news, some new shows and movies are out on Netflix. The most popular are The Munsters, A Trip to Infinity, and a new season of Never Have I Ever. Seniors, this week is College Go Week. From September 26th to the 30th, students can apply to several Indiana colleges for free. See the full list of universities that are waiving their application fees this week. This week is National Deaf Awareness Week. We will have a few signers each day signing deaf trivia facts. Here is today's trivia fact. We have a special segment today from the Dean of Students, Ms. Riney. Let's take a look. Hello, Southeastern faculty and staff. My name is Mrs. Riney. Um, along with Mr. Cummings and Mr. Giddon, I work in the Student Services Office. I specifically work with students with the last names of O through Z, grades 9 through 12. Indiana Code mandates that we share this next bit of information with you all. However, even if it weren't state law, our administration, our faculty, our staff, and our entire school community believe that the topic of bullying is taken very seriously. If you want to make this large school feel small like an interconnected, caring community, we must take pride in ourselves and each other as royals. Bullying is prohibited by Hamilton Southeastern Schools. Students who commit any acts of bullying are subject to discipline including but not limited to suspension, expulsion, arrest, and or prosecution. Indiana Code defines bullying as overt, unwanted, repeated acts or gestures involving verbal or written communications or images transmitted in any manner including digitally or electronically. That includes Instagram, Snapchat, Twitter, Facebook, or just a simple text message. Physical acts committed, aggression, or any other behavior committed by a student or group of students against another student with the intent to harass, ridicule, humiliate, intimidate, or harm the targeted student, creating for the targeted student an objectively hostile school environment. That one places the targeted student in reasonable fear or harm of his or her person or property. Two, has a substantially detrimental effect on the targeted student's physical or mental health. Three, has the effect of substantially interfering with the targeted student's academic performance or four, has the effect of substantially interfering with the targeted student's ability to participate or benefit in the services, activities, or privileges provided by the school. It's important to understand that HSE School District prohibits bullying in all forms. This policy may be applied regardless of the physical location in which the bullying behavior occurred. And HSE Schools prohibits bullying through the use of data or computer software that is accessed through any computer, computer system, computer network, or digital device. In the simplest terms, bullying is unwanted, aggressive behavior that is repeated or has the potential of being repeated and conveys a real or perceived imbalance of power. If you are the target or a suspect appear, or you suspect appear to be the target of bullying, please report this behavior to a trusted adult, including teachers, coaches, directors, administrators, or other school staff. If you are uncomfortable reporting bullying in person, please util utilize our new district's anonymous tip service through the HSE Stop It app. If you have questions about that, you can always come and see one of us. There are no report length uh, limitations and pictures, screenshots, videos, documents, and audio files can all be at attached in the Stop It app. Reporters through the app will engage in anonymous two-way communication. We do not know who you are. If you have any questions, please visit one of us here in the Student Services Office, any of our assistant principals in the main office, any of your teachers who can lead you to the right place. We are here for you. And as always, remember to take pride in yourself and in the Royals. Hey Royals, I'm Carson Radone here with your sports news. Tonight, the boys varsity and JV tennis teams are playing their IHSAA tournaments here at HSC. The matches will begin at 4.30, so be sure to head over to the tennis courts to check them out. Also, tonight, the girls varsity soccer team is taking on the Mount Vernon Marauders at 7.15. This will be a home game, so let's cheer on our Lady Royals. The girls varsity volleyball team is also hosting Hamilton Heights. That game will be at 7.30. Tomorrow the girls JV volleyball team is taking on Noblesville at home at 5.30. That's it for your news today Royals. Follow us on all social media platforms and thank you for helping us keep you informed and up to date with all things HSE.